Hello, I'm Shadow Coast, and welcome to Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. We are going to be taking over the Battlestar Galactica in an all-new resurrection campaign. It's been three years since the fall of Daedalus, when Galactica was grounded during the bombardment of Caprica City. BSG-75 has been reformed and the crew of Galactica, headed by Commander Silas Nash, are eager to rejoin the front line of the Cylon War. We're going to throw it on Fleet Admiral and jump in. I should have clicked tutorial because it's been over a year and a half or Previously so. On Battlestar Galactica I'm going to skip this. Um, but let's just jump in. I have no idea what's going on, but hopefully we'll figure it out as we go. Or well, maybe it'll explain it to us here. It worse. Leave it and you'll bleed out. Best case scenario, someone takes the knife out and helps you back up. Except for you're still bleeding. And now you got another son bitch running around with a knife. The ceasefire lasted the full year that Lapsus has agreed to. No longer, no less. The exact minute the agreement expired, Cylon fleets attacked the Cobalt Alliance colonies. We fought back where we could. Had some hard years grounded before we got Colonial Fleet back in the air. Then we went and retrieved Galactica. Pulled her right out of the water where we left her and spent the last year building her back up. Colonial Fleet is now a branch of the Ministry of Defense. Reformed by the people who'd been fighting the ground war since Caprica City was first bombarded. Jubal Sarkis leads the fleet admiralty, and he's made sure the quorum knows its place this time around. Without colonial fleet, there is no war, no resistance, and no freedom. All right, so... That makes Galactica more sense. has been reinstated to the head of BSG-75 under my command. We are, once again, one of many in the shield against the Cylon. We have a second chance and bear the full weight of the 12 colonies. From today, we do not lose to the toasters. All right, let's go take on some toasters. Okay, so I watched a few videos I posted uh, before jumping back in. So I have a general concept of controls to a degree and tactics to a degree. Uh, but we're going to figure it out as we go. Galactica and if Commander. it goes Not sure that it lives to, up to you know, CIC. whoa. Comfort wasn't our priority. Okay, so we can... we can take a moment to familiarize yourself. Sort of walk CIC around. briefing is at the top of the hour. That's cool. Um, all right, so build ships. We're not going to do that. Strategy. Okay, this is the operations deck. It looks familiar, except. Another request from Ministry Commander. Except this particular fleet is one of the. Hold on, Helios of Alpha. We take it out, and Cylon Foundations. Oh my goodness! Is there only one sector left? This must. Oh, maybe this is the sector that we can fight in. We'll see. Uh, we have a, a, f a frigate here. Let's kind of consolidate. Yeah, we have our BSG-75. That's good. Another request um, from Ministry Commander. This particular eliminate hostile of central pillars of forces. Sector. We take it out. And so we have four turns to do this. Somehow let's go on and and do that. So let's see. Let's. Uh, we're just reorienting ourselves. Over One thing watching, another thing doing. Okay, so this is the build menu. The Berserk Carrier, I think that came with one. I only purchased one of the TLCs, maybe two. So the Berserk's a pretty solid ship. But we probably... I'm trying to... The Berserk has a Viper Squad, but it doesn't have a missile. So that's good to know. Uh, one thing, when we look at the blueprints here, we have 3,000 requisition points. Ooh, we could, we could work on that. I like, I like, I think the Minotaur 
is Battlestar Group 75 is ready one of the market. best ones because it has a broadside bombardment of medium similar to the Berserk uh, but I think it has more guns Janus is just um, you put them in front of you and hit them with your medium turret or uh, you go high and hit them with your bottom turret the carriers a carrier I think yeah, broadsides heavy. I think broadsides are better. I um, mean, you can see here they carry, you know, a bunch of stuff. Turn rate size for the Minotaur size three. It has a better turn rate, better speed. Um, advantage turret range, turret accuracy, uh, penalty marine strength. Um, yeah, I think the Minotaur is my go-to because it's got the range and accuracy. What is the Berserk I like because it has turret range, turret accuracy, squadron evade, and none. So I think the big difference is firepower between the two. Uh, support, Ranger, Front bottom broadside I'm not too hot on the Ranger it's basically your missile boat uh, battle stars um, they're all kind of good but uh, um, like this one's just just the the best you get more squadrons and you can't beat so what do we what do we Galactica Battlestar. Okay, Mark II. Hell yes. So I know what I'm going to do here. That's right. We're getting the Viper. And Minotaur versus Berserk. I don't know. That was a little tough. I think we're, we're going to save for this one and then build some Berserk. So let's get to work gonna build four of you I think we can only build one at a time but we'll see how this works and we're gonna jump you in so first of all officers can we no available officers to recruit um, we have two missions Another request from ministry commander this particular fleet 16 is one of the central pillars of Cylon command in this sector we take it out, and Cylon Foundations will be that little bit weaker. So we're gonna we're gonna take on a side mission here. Resource mission ambush. So we're gonna ambush the enemy fleets, and they're not gonna know what hit them because they're not expecting the Galactica, a Jupiter Mark II battle star at the beginning of the playthrough we are on the hardest difficulty level so we will see okay gonna kind of go we're gonna stay low with our adamants kind of stack I think the guns at the bottom all right look at this he is ridiculous plus 5% damage reduction on the Galactica so the Galactica has the most hit points so we're gonna put uh, the Galactica out front to soak up damage hopefully our shields are strong enough to absorb the majority of the hits but we're gonna put the galactic a little further out Greatest front contacts. Cylon fleet is present okay so to that end yes sir got it Yes, sir. Launching fighters. 
Oh. We have to switch the fighters out. It's not automatic. Shoot. That I did not remember. Well, that's okay. I mean, we expect there to be a lot of learning, and this battle is going to tell us a lot. Uh, Tactics-wise, we just kind of stack and kind of slightly put the one we want to get hit first a little further forward. I'm on it, Commander. And if memory serves, I think yes, sir. the battle stars are a little bit better. Um, all right, so we're gonna go send you here to go reveal. Well, they have their own, and we should have launched. Actually, start turning this way. Got it. And we're gonna try to. I'm on it, Commander. I'm gonna try to take these guys out. Squadron target. All right, I really wish I had upgraded those, but that's okay. Um, we're gonna fire guided missiles there, and then everyone else is gonna turn so we get the broadside going. say we are. And we're gonna, yeah, focus fire this guy. I really want to take that guy out, so I think this should this work. Because this is just like a small Corvette type. And yes. Nice. Okay, so. So say we all. And by the way. You guys come back to normal, and that's gonna allow us to. Got it. Yes, Commander. Hopefully, turn a little more. I don't think it actually did anything. I'm on it, Commander. So that made sense. So we isolated two. We took them out. Select you 
fire munitions. And our squads are getting damaged heavily because we didn't do the Mark II. Defensive here. Yes, sir. I'm on it, Commander. Let's recall. And you don't have any flak going on. Let's uh, amp up the attack. are going to focus Take the Manticore yes. out of the fight. Salvo launch ready. And we're going to yes, recall sir. all these fighters. These Corvettes are designed to take out fighters. They have weaker weapons against capital ships, which is what yes, we sir. have. At least that's my understanding. It's been a while since I played so this game, so I could be wrong. Just like conceptually, that should be the case. Yeah, these guys are all focused on attacking. Friendly squadron is gone. Yeah. The Galactica shields are going to be able to. 
don't think there's much we have to actually do here. Mission in. We lost more fighters than we wanted. The Vil Vilnius um, got an upgrade. Three ships destroyed. So experience. So I don't know if that impacts anything, but we're going to assume that more experienced ships are better and try not to lose them. Um, effectively, we're going to put the battle star out, try to isolate enemies. Okay, so how does this work? So we're going to repair. We'll repair the fleet. Ah, oh, there we go. I would have gotten tons of Viper 2s. Um, okay. We can do missiles or proximity mines. We could torpedo. Unguided. Um, it could work. I don't remember it working super efficiently. Can we recruit? Yes. So he's unexperienced. Can we stick him in our fleet? Oh. No, he needs his own fleet. Son of a gun! Some days it feels like Ministry wants us to be the golden poster boy for their recruitment drives. Other days, like we're their janitors, cleaning up everyone else's mess. All right. It's nice to have something uncomplicated ahead of us for once. Um. Twenty-four hundred. I don't know. I feel like. The Berserk is tough because it's got the fighter complement, but the Minotaur can take a much bigger hit. 5,000 Dratus range, 5,000 Dratus range. Um, the Manticore has 7,000, so... Yeah, the fighters. Janus, four thousand, four thousand. We're gonna save up. We're gonna save up. All right, let's go take on. We've repaired. We've swapped off good fighters. Uh, support. What? What is the? Damage reduction. I'm I I could regret this, but um, we're gonna rush. And if I'm not mistaken, come over here. Transfer. Yeah, I didn't reduce any of our points. doesn't count okay so I, I might regret that but we'll save up for the Jupiter mark 2 and the berserk will be our uh, core mainstay ship 230 tilium that's okay we're taking this on and then we'll probably call this a first episode if you want to see more of this playthrough in Battlestar Galactica deadlock 
please post comments. Please drop these this video a thumbs up and let me know. Um, and I'm happy to post more of my journey playing through. I did not read the description. Uh, but we're going to... I think you can launch missiles, if I read that right. So... Our battle star, we want to go in kind of first. And these guys, we want to be um, the manticores. We want to be... So you have longer Dratus range. I guess the question is... The one thing I did not properly understand, and I'm going to put you guys over here. The one thing I did not understand at all was um, line of sight. So Dratus range is one thing. So you can see their blip. Um, viewing and targeting them is another thing. So let's see how this support ship works. I jump complete. Think Greatest it can do stuff in, in combat. I don't remember. IFFs confirmed. Engage with the toasters. Not a single one of them gets to run back to Gemini. This is a cakewalk, people. We do our jobs. We kill the enemy. We live up to the name of Galactica and Colonial Fleet. Take it from here, Commander. Oh. Okay, so Battle Star. So say we all. You come up here. Okay. So, I might have not done a very good job. Yes, Commander. Yeah. Launching drones. That's right, you have... You have drones. That's what it is. That can plate stuff. Do you have restock guided missiles? Oh, you can. Oh, wow. So, in prolonged combat situations, you can restock people. Um, that is excellent. Yes, Commander. Yes, sir. Got it. Launching alert vipers. Okay. Uh, at least one of your. Oh boy. What are you doing? Yes, sir. I'm glad they had that warning. I'm on it, Commander. Yes, Commander. Yes, Commander. Okay. So we're gonna fire missiles. Um, fire missiles. Fire missiles. And then we're gonna go you are not, but you guys are going to go full on offensive. You cannot do anything, so that's okay. You're plated. And. Uh, 
I don't see any little guys yet, so we're gonna hold on to our squadrons. Hostile line detected. Hey, Commander. Is it true you were one of the last people off the Daedalus before, well, you know, all of that? <laughs> that was not the time for backstory, as you say. Just saying, sir. Feels good to have another bona fide Chrome Buster on deck. The Galactica looks like it's taken some hits already. You guys seeing this? So I'll recruit and all what the heck is Sing doing? Like, hand, focus, man. We're in the middle of battle. So say we all. Oh. All right, we're definitely putting you into harm's way, which is the plan. You have your armor plating. Yes, sir. Okay. I... Got it. I think you guys should go over there. gonna turn just in case since you're kind of out front which is what we want That's what I thought. This was incoming. Ooh. Who's hacked? Who they hack? They just hack me? I think they just hacked yes, me. In. say we all got it I'm on it commander got it all right all right we gotta you gotta fix that um, who's taking a hit gotta put you out there we want you to be the the target of opportunity and we're gonna launch our squadrons and they're gonna take out that guy squadron is taking fire Celestra is taking damage oh boy those jerks So say we all. Missile tubes prepped. All right. 
do we have any can we focus fire this dude Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, you two Minotaurs, focus fire on this guy. You just get the heck out of here. it not one bit all right two turns two turns salvo launch ready Alright, these Celestes, oh boy, they're arming it right there, wow, Jupiter is taking damage. ow, down. Fleet is cleaning that up. cluster bomb just action, came Those over, set up, and for. nailed Don't us. Cocky, Lieutenant. We've still got a whole war ahead of us yet. This guy's just leveling up super fast. Our Admiral's maxed out, so we want to put that other guy in to our second fleet as soon as possible. Admiral, welcome aboard. Thought I'd get a bit more time before you came with the leash. Silas, good to see you back on your feet. How's you handle it? Still rough around the edges. But better than expected, given the timeline. Mr. Quaid's lived up to his end of the bargain. I guess that means we have to live up to ours. We can let him stew on Verbon for a little while longer. He hasn't earned his chance at a new life just yet. It is good to see Galactica back in the sky. It means a lot to the people back home. It means something to those of us still here as well. Though, I'm surprised Larson didn't ask you for a ground transfer at the Ministry. After she personally pulled you out of the ocean, we both know the first sergeant would be your XO if we could prize the rifle out of her hands. Eleanor Larson isn't going anywhere. Semper Fidelis to the grave. And Agathon didn't come with you. She is still active, I assume. The Praetor's needed elsewhere. If you feel your crew is ready to turn around, I've got another outing we could use you at. But I'd understand if you opt for sure leave first. Go visit your boy. Looks like he's grown. Looks like Silas has a son. I'll have the CIC cleared for your briefing in 20. All right, all business. We'll respect that um, repair fleet for sure. So these guys have leveled up. So plus 10% max distance, plus 5% 5 act turret accuracy. Um, we're still a rookie. Proximity mines, that's okay, we don't. 
That's that's all good. So how does this work? E no, they are we can build three at a time. Hmm. Hmm. That's kind of nice. That is super nice and important to know. All right, so here's the deal. If what Cylon Threat 18, we just took off. New objective, Commander. Admiralty wants every bit of data on these satellites wiped clean. Cylon so threat will decrease by 20 upon, upon completion. Some days it feels like 17. Wants us okay. To be the poster boy for the recruitment okay, trial. so. Other days like we're their janitors, cleaning up everyone else's mess. Get into nice enemy fleet points 4,000. New objective, Commander. Admiralty wants every bit of data on these satellites wiped clean. 4,000. Okay. All right. So, Sarkis has opted for a complete explosive. If you want to see more, Instead definitely more comment. Select all um, we're going to go the body resurrected, and then either delete all or high priority target. Maybe high priority target. And we're just going to keep knocking them off the board. Uh, we're going to get the blueprint for. The J2 Battlestar, because it's awesome. That's the Galactica. Uh, we'll have our second fleet be that Mark II, ideally plus four Berserks, assuming we can field that many based off the number of points. And then if we look at our officers, Wilbert Simmon, Ray Biggs, yeah, Wilbert Simmon, we're gonna. We're gonna we're gonna call him Wilbert de Dilbert. Wilbert de Dilbert uh, is going to be our next up and coming officer. So he is CIC subsystem strength, which is nice. But this is what we're really into: command fleet points. So we want to grab those and then. Um, we're definitely going to want this damage reduction, which is super important. If we look at Nash, plus one posture range, it looks like he can still level up, but I'm not, I'm not entirely confident how this all works. Um, I don't know if I got an officer to get every single point, but he plus five CIC subsystem strength is is nice. Um, this guy engineering subsystem that's not bad. I feel like I feel like CIC is kind of like the natural place I'm gonna want to be um, to help, but. But, uh, but we'll see. Um, we'll see. I think... I think Wilbert to Dilbert will be good. I think it'll be good. We'll see. So let me know if you want to see more. And thanks so much for watching. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing. And I hope to see you in future videos. Shadow Coast out.